Uh, in simple ways, an ass kicking. That's probably the simplest way right there. Joe said you guys prepared well, did a lot of good things, shoot around, everything else, felt you guys were ready to go. Did you feel that same way? Yeah. Um, well, it felt good, felt confident, and um, just didn't play the way we've been playing. Derek, you took six timeouts before the end of the third. Who's his message during those, and what's his message after the game? Uh, I'm just trying to find a way to kind of get going. Um, you're just going to learn from this game and um, go back home. Derek, you've been in a lot of playoffs here. Is there any way to mimic that sense of desperation that a team has now? Uh, yeah, I mean, not exactly, but um, I mean, as we've seen today, like they just played harder, and that's unacceptable. I also said you guys didn't really need to make many adjustments over the first three games. What what did they do that made you a little less comfortable tonight with, with what you have been doing? Yeah, I mean, I just think that just they they played harder, and um, just every loose ball, 50-50 ball, they got to it, and um, I mean, obviously the turnovers and missed shots. Um, to combine with that, it's not not a winning re recipe. You guys responded so well in the in game three. What was different tonight after they punched first in the first? Um, I mean, they just I don't know. Uh, we just didn't respond. Uh, you just got to learn from it, and it's going to be a, a, a big one here, game five. Speaking of response, you guys have done that all year long, especially here on the playoffs. How much are you looking forward to taking it to court in game five Monday? Yeah, yeah I mean, all year. Um, we responded well to whatever has been thrown at us, and so um, that would be no difference on Monday. Derek, you have the weekend now to think about things. What's the challenge for you guys to get yourself in the right mindset for Monday? Just have that growth mindset we've had all year. Um, learn from learn from this game. You know that they're not going away. This, this is the NBA Finals, and we got to have to uh, play to a certain level to, to get a win. The biggest thing you feel I like can't carry over to the next one. What, what do you like absolutely have to do better in the next one? You just gotta play harder. Start with that. Joe talks a lot about process over results in terms of the way that you guys orchestrate offense. Did you feel like the process was the same tonight? You were getting the same quality of looks, or did they do something to kind of jump that up on you? Yeah, I mean, obviously, you watch the film, you know, know a little bit more, but uh, I mean, I think we got some good looks and um, just didn't make them. Uh, but obviously, like, when you watch the film, you, you learn more. What was Joe's message in the locker room afterwards? Uh, just learn from it. Um, you know, say too much, and we'll, we'll talk about it when we get back to Boston. You guys kind of study two different types of things. It's like basketball film and then killer whales, UFC, soccer, whatever it is. When you're in a big game like this, it's like the clinching game. You've never been in anything quite like this before. What do you tap into to try to like find your footing? Are you thinking more like X's and O's stuff, or are you thinking about like being a killer whale, getting on a chokehold? Um, I mean, the X's and O's obviously is important. The details, um, that's really what we're focused on. Uh, which is the mindset. Uh, we just need to be. You just got to have that mindset to to kind of finish off your opponent. So uh, it's a little bit of both. Without Kristaps, how do you get rim protection? You guys are undersized. I mean, it's hard to replace KP, obviously, but um, you just got to do a better job on the ball and um, try to contain them, try to make them take difficult shots. Derek Lively just was, was a force today. Um, you guys had tr trouble with him. What was it about the way he played today that really uh, made him hard to stop? Yeah, he was he was great tonight. Um, we just got to match his, his uh, intensity. Derek, how much you Last question. How much are you looking forward to being at home? On Monday night, what are you expecting from your fans? You're yeah, looking forward to it. Um, it's going to be a big game. Uh, I know they're going to show out and they're going to support us, and so it's going to be a lot of fun. Thank you.